All right, what I've done is I've uh, tied on a, actually this is a cobweb broom, and um, cobweb brooms and round brooms are similar, except that, of course, round brooms are bigger and they've got more layers of uh, <clears throat> broom corn in them. But when you're sewing them on, they're the same way. So I've got about three yards of uh, linen here, wax linen. So I'm going to do a lark's head knot. It goes like this, comes around here. Okay, let's see it again. Lark's head knot. Two fingers. Touch your fingers and there you go. Okay, so I want to make sure that I don't hit the wood down here. I'm actually making this for my raven that's downstairs so that he can fly like an eagle. So I'm going to go around twice on this, put it through the lark's head loop there and then I'm going to cinch it up and you should probably do uh, especially on a cobweber you only need to do a couple rows of this I'm going to tighten that up and you see what I've used is just like a rubber band to hold it down tight and that might be a little bit too tight but it'll work so I'm going to take my broom needle or bodkin and thread it through it. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go underneath that broom corn at an angle and come up. And then I'm going to come across that, for you probably vertical bar, and diagonally once again so it'll be a straight stitch across the top and diagonally down at the bottom that, or through the corn that you won't see. Okay, so I'm diagonal there, or not diagonal, across from it and then I'm gonna stitch underneath it. So, and because this is small, you can see that it's not gonna take any time at all to stitch this up. So like I said, you should do two, at least two rows of sewing on your brooms and if you want to do three, that's good too. If you wanted to get fancy, you could do like a cross stitch where you'd have X's, and that's fun too. Go one way and then go the other. So I'm going to do about one more row of stitch in here. And then all you do is you go through the width of the broom, oops, pull it tight, cut it off, and voila. Like most things, it's pretty simple once you know how to do it. So, there you go. There's, And then I'll put a second row on there, and then that will be my broom for my raven to hang on.